Good morning, and welcome to the first episode of Easy Buckets. I'll be your coach, Eric Williams, and over the next few episodes, we'll teach you how to remain active while at home, but also how to become a better basketball player while in the process. So let's get going. All right, guys, so for our first drill, we're gonna work on our footwork. I like to call these jump stops. You'll hear that a lot of times. These are some of the fundamentals that you have to incorporate into your game in order to be a successful basketball player. So I'm gonna start here on the baseline, okay? I'm gonna get a good solid base. I'm gonna make sure that I'm low, my chest is out, and my head is up, okay? First thing you wanna make sure that we do is have a positive step, okay? In basketball, you don't ever wanna take a negative step. You always wanna take a positive step, okay? So here we go. First thing we're gonna do is a positive step, okay? I'm still low to the ground. My head is up, my chest is out. Okay, I'm quicker this way. I'm quicker, I'm stronger, I'm faster this way, okay? So we're gonna take three dribbles. One, two, three, jump stop. You see that I'm here, I'm not leaning forward. I'm straight up and down, okay? Make sure you're on good balance, you have a good base, okay? So here again, we're gonna take a positive step. Take three dribbles right here. One, two, three, jump stop. Again, positive step. Still low, I'm low to the ground, my chest is up, my butt is down, okay? Jump stop, positive step, okay? We're gonna do two sets of these, okay? Two sets. Three dribbles, two sets. Right hand up, left hand back. Back with our left hand, so we're gonna step with our left, left foot this side, so it's a positive step going left, okay? Left hand, left foot. Same, con same concept of butt, okay? Here we go. We're here, triple threat position, positive step, one, two, Jump stop. Good base. Not leaning forward, not falling forward. Okay, here we go. Pop step one, two, three, jump stop. Okay? So we just learned how to do a proper jump stop. Now we're going to incorporate a pivot with our jump stop. So it's very simple and it goes like this. Okay? So we're going to start here, triple thread. We want our balance. Good base. We're going to throw it out with a positive step. Jump stop. It's called a front pivot or forward pivot. Take the ball from right to left. We want to get it down by our shoelaces here. Rip part. Pivot. Pivot. Same thing. Throw it out. Jump stop. Triple thread. Pivot. Pivot. Keep the ball low away from the defender. Give it the last time. Here, jump stop two feet at the same time. Rip right to left. Pivot. That's how you do the top work forward. Alright guys, the next segment we're gonna jump into is ball handling. As a guard, as a big, as a forward, it doesn't matter who you are, you have to be able to learn how to dribble the ball. Left hand, right hand, it doesn't matter. You need to be able to use both your hands to be able to create space to be able to get to the basket to be to the finger. So today we're gonna work on our ball handling skills. And the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna work on pounding the ball, okay? Same thing applies for the jump stops, okay? We have a good base, solid base, long balance, okay? Chest is out, hands up, we're getting low, dropping our butts, okay? The first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna pound it. Right in place, we're gonna pound it, not too high, not too low, okay? Here we go, so pound, go. Here, solid base, heads up, butt down, chest out. Here we go. Come up, eyes up, head up, butt down. 30 seconds. Next one, between the legs. On the between the legs, we're just doing one leg at a time. So we can start with our left leg, we start with our right leg, it doesn't matter. Okay, we're getting low. Ball's gonna go between the legs, back and forth. 30 seconds each leg. Here we go. Eyes up. If you mess up, it's okay. Eyes up, quick. Quick as you can, you gotta push yourself. You gotta get your heart rate going. Eyes up, see the floor. Switch. Right leg, 30 seconds, ready to go. Quick. 
Okay guys, the next one is behind the back, okay? It's very, very important that you stay low behind the back and keep the ball low, okay? Same rules apply, good balance, good base, chest out, butt down, okay? I know it's kind of difficult, so right now just pound it, push through, pound it, push through, pound it, push through, and as you start to get it, speed it up, okay? Push, speed it up, quick as you can, okay? It's okay to mess up. Quick feet, left, right, okay? So here again, here, 
right, your triple threat. Same rules apply, up, snap, ball land on the block. Same thing. So, run two, left, right, here, up. You want to get it straight out of the line as possible. Last thing we're gonna work on is our feet, okay? Our footwork into our shot. As a shooter, you always wanna be able to get your shot off as quick as possible, okay? I've learned that at a, at a young age that if you can't get your shot off, you're no use to the, to the coach for shooting, okay? So we're gonna work on our feet as of right now. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna roll the ball out, okay? We're gonna work on left to right as of right now. Don't worry about right to left. We're gonna do left to right. So the thing is, we're gonna roll it out, Catch, boom, boom, eyes to the rim. And again, quick, quick feet. Left, right, boom. They like to call it ball in the air, feet in the air. So as the ball's in the air, my feet, one, two, I'm up into my shot. See? Shot prep, my shot prep. Okay? One, two. Here we go. One, two. I'm ready. I'm exploding into my shot. So now I'm going to shoot the shot. See if I can make it. Alright guys, so that's it with the quick beat. Remember, we're down, we're low, we're ready to go. Left, right, right into our shot. Okay, so that's it for today. We'll come back tomorrow. We have some good information for you. So just make sure that you take this and implement it to your game. It's a way for you to be at home right now and also stay active. So thank you for joining in with us today. Look forward to seeing you guys tomorrow on episode two.